Hello and welcome to Vision Academy. In this video, we are going to study lab program 8. Write a Python program to find the grade of a student when grades are allocated as given in the table below. Above 90% A, 80% to 90% B, 70% to 80% C, 60% to 70% D, below 60% E. Percentage of the marks obtained by the student is input to the program. Here, let us take percentage variable as p usually the percentage is in terms of a real number hence we are going to take a floating point type of data and inside the round bracket we will take input function and inside this round bracket in a double quotation mark we will ask the user to enter the percentage end the double quotation mark and close these brackets now we will check out the condition if this percentage is greater than 90 and colon as per the syntax of if statement if this condition is true then it has to print with indentation we have to write print function over here in a double quotation mark it has to print grade a and put the double quotation mark and close the bracket if this condition is false then l if the next condition if p is greater than 80 and colon if this is true with indentation we have to write print statement and it should display grade p and the double quotation mark and close the bracket next l if statement again check out the percentage if it is greater than 70 and colon with indentation, we will write print statement, and here it should display grade C. End the double quotation mark and close the bracket. Here I don't have space to write, so let me write over here. So once again, I'll check out the next condition using elif statement. P is greater than 60. Colon. If this is true with indentation, I will write print grade. End the double quotation mark and close the bracket. So we can check out below 60%, E should be displayed. So if this condition is false, then else part will get executed. Here I'm going to write else colon with indentation. I'm going to write print and in a double quotation mark, I'm going to write grade E. End the double quotation mark and close the bracket. Let us check out its output. So once we execute this program it will ask the user to enter the percentage here i'm going to write enter the percentage for example i'm going to type 90 and press enter what will happen if percentage p is having value 90 90 is greater than 90 no condition is false once this condition is false then this print grade A will not get executed. Control jumps to next condition. Here, P is what? 90. 90 is greater than 80. Yes, condition is true. Then it is going to print grade B. What if I want to print grade A? So I have to write the percentage should be greater than 90. If I write 91, then this condition will become true. So once again, you execute this program. It will ask the user to enter the percentage. So at the second run, I am going to enter 91. So 91 is stored in the variable p. Now we will check out 91 is greater than 90. Yes, condition is true. If this condition is true, then grade A will be printed. So next, you can check out else part. If the percentage is below 60, then it should display grade E. Now we will execute this program one more time and it will ask the user to enter the percentage. Now I am going to enter 60 or below 60. Right now I am going to enter 60. So here P is holding value 60. Whether 60 is greater than 60? No, condition is false. Then else part will get executed. So it is going to print grade E. Now it's time to go for executing this program. Let us check out its output. 
now we have uh, come to vs code and let us uh, click on file and here new file and now i'm going to type lab 8.py and press enter here you can observe we are right now in a lab 8.py file let us write p is equal to i'll write floating point type of data and inside the bracket i'll write input and in a double quotation mark i'll ask the user to enter the percentage now i'm going to fast forward this video so that we can save our time Now it's time to execute this program. Before that, I'll press Ctrl S to save this file. Click on Run. Click on Start Debugging. Here it is displaying the result. Enter the percentage. For example, here I'm going to enter 90 and press Enter. So it is displaying Grade B. Why? Because here the percentage is greater than 90. If this condition is true, then Grade A will be printed. So greater than 90 means above 90 is the only one value that is satisfying this particular condition in that situation grade a will be printed otherwise grade b will be printed so let us execute this program one more time click on run click on start debugging so here it is asking the user to enter the percentage here what i'm going to do is i'm going to press 91 and press enter here you can observe grade a is displayed now let us check out whether the else part will get executed successfully or not by entering percentage less than 60 even if i enter 60 which is not greater than 60 hence it should display the grade e let us go to run and click on start debugging so here you can observe it is asking the user to enter percentage now i'm going to enter 60 and press enter now you can clearly see that grade e is displaying I hope you understood this program if so please write down in the comment box as understood and if you want to check out this program along with the flowchart then the link is given in the description below thank you so much for watching this video till the end we will see you in the next video